honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with divers. Technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you saying we shouldn't dive? If we just go down and take a look, who's gonna know? If this is your first unreported wreck, then you should know there's a very specific protocol you have to follow. For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Don't do anything stupid that'll get my ass in trouble. Wow, that is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. But I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. We almost died. You're shitting me, right? You're shitting me, right? What? <laughs> like there's a hidden camera down here or something? Uh. Okay, come on, guys. The gig is up. Julia. I'm serious. I need time to think about this. You know, I'm all for love. Go ahead and say yeah. Alex, wow. What a goddamn story. How's it end? I mean, it's very unique. Yes, yes I'll marry the shit out of you. <laughs> uh, how many people can propose underwater while scuba diving? I'm all for that. All right, handsome all right. girl. Can we get out of here now? You want to get on with our escape from the, uh... Crumbling death trap? Yes, please, because there's a shark still swimming Swiss, around. This is Julia. We're coming back up. Over. Hey, where'd that other boat come from? Um did they just leave or did Wait. something happen? Julia, we gotta decompress here. Whoa! Damn! Oh what shit! The fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. What do you mean decompress? My brother's up there, damn it. Yeah, okay. Be cautious. Damn it. Yeah, okay. Decompress, right. Is that a scuba term? Is this taking too long? Oh my god, this is taking too long. This is torture. Just a few more seconds. Okay, now. Go, go. What the hell happened? It's cool, man. Everything's all right now. Are y'all grilling? What the hell is this? There was a little uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. Why are you paying the ocean? What's up with the other boat? What's up with the other boat? What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit! Uh. Dude, bro, congrats! Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. Yeah, let's get out of shark-filled water, please. Y'all are still just casually just sitting in there. Oh god, you're gonna tell me I did horrible, didn't you? You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad, a bold fellow, you might say? Or maybe you'd say arrogant. And then there's Captain both. Fliss, strong, forthright, stubborn. 
She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you. Special you feature them to make some decisions they'll value later on. You're doing well. Okay, he said I'm doing well, so we're good. Okay. So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball... Meatball? This meatball pulls a ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Yeah, where well, did you hide that? to say, this lady was impressed. <laughs> well played there, man, no? Wasn't Comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Oh, we found a bullet lodged in the plane. Huh. I left oh, yeah, it below deck if you want to check it out. She was going to tell him that. So, how does it feel to soon be known as the Mr. Julia Smith? It does have a nice ring. I'll stick my own name. It has a nice ring to it. Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel, but now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So, I guess we should talk about wedding plans. Eventually. Let's plan it together. Dad can foot the bill. Uh, plan it together, I guess. Now you're speaking my language. I'm taking lessons. Yeah, I can't wait for us to plan everything together. I was so worried you might say no. I wasn't sure how to respond. Just reassure him. Of course I was gonna say yes, you dimwit. I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. So you can walk all over me? Uh let's... I love you, Alex. Yeah, let's keep it let's keep it all lovey dovey and calm and cool and collected. Where did we go? There was much celebration to be had. I'll go find them. You just relax. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's There's go only so many sure. places they can be, which is downstairs, obviously. So, which one is, uh, you know, where the magic happens? Uh, what? Give it a rest. Apologize for my brother. Yeah, let's do that. On behalf of my family, I'd like to apologize for my brother acting like a horny fifth grader. Ah, uh, it's okay. I can deal with children. Conrad, beers, <laughs> where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. I'm trying to keep everything, like, as neutral as possible. Don't want nobody, like, turning on each other, nothing like that. All right, now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Uh, wait, why are you moving so fast? Uh oh, let's let her see it. Let's see what this does. Nothing? Honestly, Nothing triggered? Memorable? Just not that memorable. What is this? Oh, the camera. I have to hand it to you. Bopping the question on the bottom of the ocean like that is pretty romantic. Isn't it though? Like, it's very never thought you were the settling type. I'm proud of you, bro. Next. I couldn't have done it without such a good bro, bro. It's a unique proposal, but like right after the shark damn near ate you, you that's me. just kinda of freaky. One, I'm not that savvy. And two, I was talking about med school. Still. We're over the top, bro. Air Rescue Service, Conwyn Island. So, Definitely the same more? people from the beginning. Uh, yeah. The, the dead it's body. Dangerous for my blood. The another dead body. How many times I have to tell you not to be such a wuss? All right, that's it. All hey, right. Got the pad yet? Sorry, I got distracted. No worries. Let's go get it.
Got it. Let's go up. Come here, you vixen. Uh oh. They getting a little freaky dinky. Hey, Tiger, we should get back. Right here. All right, let's uh, start this little conversation we're about to have. He said, "No, nah, I don't <laughs> want no, no more." resistance there. All right, everyone, check it out. Manchurian gold. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? So what do you think, Captain? Coordinates? Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination? You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. <sighs> wow. Do you find anything else? This plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? I told you to leave everything down there alone. Oh, come on. Why did you just like, already. I'm not out. talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Nobody knows. Okay, maybe. Say nothing. Just apologize. You're right. We should have been more careful. That's not me. I'm sorry. Okay. Maybe. I don't know you. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but every single thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. Oh, here we go. I never thought about it like that. Damn ghost you never stories. never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? He looks like Michael B. Jordan yeah, a lot. I don't I know if that's story. who that Happens is. Happens right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use a good show. Ew. Oh, let's hear it. I don't, I don't. Let's hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Scare away, little bro. Okay. Oh, he's telling a story. Here goes. This story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait. True story? Where'd you hear this? If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. Shut up. One track mind, shush. He of the one track mind. The woman answers, I live here in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical and his sister parents are upstairs. So they go to the top of the lighthouse and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an ax. Always oh, an axe. Okay. I mean, do people even use axes anymore? Okay, fine. Then it was a meat hook. They were slashed with a meat hook and hung from the rafters. Changing the murder weapon? That's gross. Yeah, why are you changing the murder weapon? Wait a minute. Are you changing the murder weapon? I thought this was a true story. There's a lot of blood. A lot of carnage. Who's to say how it was done? Okay, so who did it? So the woman, uh, she's still hysterical says her husband did it and he's still here in the closet ha the husband eh so is this a warning to all future brides hey no backseas you're locked in so the lighthouse keeper <laughs> creeps over in. to the closet opens the door and sure enough there's a man inside but he sliced out his own insides with a meat hook horrified he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark closer closer and he sees it's his own face and then its eyes bulge out and screams oh jeez 
gross. Hey, oh, super twist. Nice. Did his face just change? Nice one, Squire. Wasn't scary. Oh, I was scared. Cool story. You have me going. Pretty cool. Heavy on the cheese there, corn dog. Okay, you've all had your fun. We should all turn in. There's some weather hitting our way. Uh uh. No, no, no. That was pretty according damn to standard vessel regulation, we're all required. One more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Uh, it's standard issue regulatory institutional protocol subdivision 1099. Uh huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just following orders, man. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> and for good, buddy. And uh, there's a storm going on. Yeah, they're not going to be able to make wherever they're trying to go in those couple of hours. I'm not trying to be out on no boat in no storm with sharks everywhere. None of that. Oh! I looked down to read the bottom left, and then they were just fucking standing there. That's those three guys that were in the boat before. The one I ran into us, I think. ready for that oh X got you this time I'm not falling for it you gotta be so quick oh damn they already got him too I oh, don't stab me in the throat please This is what you get for being an ass. Throwing money at these dudes. Mm. You can piss this dude off. Alright, one eye Willie. What the hell do you want? Where's bread? Ungag, ungag. Uh, ungag, ungag him. Hmm. RT. Oh. There you go. Gotta get some brawn out there. There you go. Now ungag her. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get your fiance. Oh, yeah, rip it so hard, bro. Julia, you okay? I think so. Oh, no. Why is he, why are you bleeding? Hey, hey, damn it, stop it! Oh no. Almost free. Hey, so, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh god damn it, Conrad! No, it's definitely are. Just great. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How is that good news? I thought you were gonna ask the good news first. You're such an idiot, Jesus. Hey, Alex, what are they gonna do to us? I don't even want to know. I want to get out of here. I'm in a lot of danger. Investigate, untie. Investigate, because we got to make sure they're not coming. Yeah. 
You're gonna regret this, you piece of shit. You're gonna rot in a cell. Oh god, he's coming back. Oh, we probably should have untied her. Uh uh. Ah, fuck off. Ah. I'll be back for you later. Oh yeah? Think so? Conrad! Nobody knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. Treat a lady. What do you want? Yeah, what the hell do you want? What do you fuckers want? Oh no. Stop! Please, just stop. Slow down. Easy. Please just stop. Fuck you. No, no. Just stop, man. I wanted to say nothing. I'm already beat this shit. Best behavior, little man. Why are you bleeding, sir? Say nothing. Don't say anything. Don't get your ass whooped anymore. Oh God. Julia, they're coming back. Put your hands back. Beyonce. You gonna sit there, dude? Get the fuck up and break the door down. No, but I'm sure he's fine. No, I hope he's okay. I hope he is. No, I didn't. I hope he's all right. All right. Turn around. Don't let them see your hands. Once we get Julia back. Maybe we could take him by surprise. Okay, they're coming. Why does he keep coming in and out? Who the hell is that dude? Fuckers. Hey, hey, are you okay? What did they do to you? I'm fine. They didn't touch me. They asked about our parents. What? How much money they have. Oh. Alex, I'm so sorry. What? What is it? They took my ring. <sighs> Julia, it's okay. It's okay. I mean, shit, I don't care as long as you are alright. As soon as dude come back in, I'm beating the fuck out of him. Now we just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. Or not, or you can go out there and do something. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just counting each time. 
between... The storm's eight miles away. We came here on a boat. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. The main guy here. He's got a gun. Well, at least one of us can get on their boat. Get some help. Ooh, these fuckers need to pay. I can get on the boat. If you can distract them, I can get on that boat. The dude with the gun won't even realize until I'm long gone. Seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. We're gonna break them during the thunder. <sighs> Good call. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys, distract them. Conrad, just stay focused and get to the boat. Okay. Escape, just escape. You know what? I've had enough. I want you off my boat right That's now. That's what he was planning to do, just Get escape. Off my damn boat. <sighs> what the hell? Oh god. You're good, you're good, you're good, you're good, good. Go, 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 get the fuck out of here. We're good. Oh, shit. Don't shoot me. Oh! Oh, they did We can't catch him with this old junker. Bring them downstairs. Take this. Use it if you have to. Okay, we got him out of there, so he's gonna get help. Bro, if you don't fight, I would have been down. hit this man. Over there. You. They got Over one there. gun. Sit. No. And where the hell is Brad? Arrêtez, bande de con! C'est mon bateau! Stop! Ferme la, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule! Oh, they found that. Come here. Oh, it's only three of them, man. Like I could have been did Which at least one, one of them dirty already. Tell me about this Manchurian goo. Just talking. You wanna talk? Keep the volume down. Sir, why are you bleeding? Answer me this. Flitz has gotta be in on this. She and these guys, they travel in the same waters. She's a captain and they barely laid a hand on her. I bet you told them about the Manchurian gold. They're in cahoots. What? How dare you? It isn't true. It isn't true. I can't believe what I'm hearing. I just lost everything I have, and this is what you think? You're all in this together. 
This was a trap, and you set us yeah, up. Yeah, asshole. Put a cork in it. He's just doing this. Thing. Oh damn it! It's so fast. Sit still, all of you. You come with me. Oh, now they don't like each other. Find out how long the storm is gonna last. Will you try anything? Anything fishy. And there'll be consequences. Get it. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Dude, we read you. Everything okay? Over. Ask for help. How bad's the storm? Hey, uh, just requesting any information about this storm you can give us? It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty hard, but should pass through your coordinates within an hour. You sound a little stressed, Duke. Please let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. Nothing wrong. Serious problems. Nothing wrong. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A okay out here. We can handle a couple of puffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. Yeah, keep it cool. Don't want to piss them off. God, ah, man, this. I can't do these controls. I don't have an Xbox controller. It would have been a lot easier. Shit, shit, what do I do? You could help. Okay, keep a lid on it. It could be our ticket out. Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh, yeah. That was a good choice, good choice. Kill down there. Shut up, you're so loud. A big boy. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put for now. That was the guy that jumped in that boat and died. Brad, if you are not awake by now, 